Methane is one of the worst greenhouse gases in our atmosphere. If carbon dioxide is the bad guy, then methane is the supervillain. Methane has 21 times the heat trapping ability of carbon dioxide. That means it would take 21 molecules of carbon dioxide to equal the amount of heat that one molecule of methane can trap. However, methane can also be used as a fantastic source of fuel. When methane is burned to produce electricity or to power other processes, it is converted into CO2 and H2O. Methane that is used as a renewable fuel is called biogas. A potential source of profitable methane are the many dairy and pig farms that are found all across America. Biogas can be made from cow and pig manure. To make biogas from this source, we have to use an anaerobic digester. To convert the manure into fuel, an anaerobic digester uses the following steps. In step one, bacteria consume the organic matter in the manure. In step two, the bacteria turn the organic matter into simple organic acids. In step three, different bacteria then take the simple acids and convert them into methane biogas. In step four, this methane biogas can then be burned to produce power or compressed to be used as transportation fuel. Not only does methane biogas provide a renewable source of energy from waste while converting a harmful greenhouse gas, it also produces valuable benefits, including reduced farm waste odors, high quality fertilizer, reduced water pollution, and a source of bedding or gardening pots. Any anaerobic digester must have the following components. First, we need a method to collect the manure. Next, we need an airtight container for bacterial digestion of organic solids. Third, we need a way to collect the methane gas created by the digesting bacteria. Fourth, we need a device to burn or compress the methane. And finally, we need a method to remove the byproducts. The U.S. Environmental Protection Agency believes that 8,200 dairy and pig farmers could support a methane digester on their farm. If all of these farms had a methane digester, they could produce 13 million megawatts of energy. This would provide enough renewable, homegrown energy to shut down two or three fossil fuel power plants permanently, all while reducing the amount of potent methane in the atmosphere in a way that provides additional income to America's farmers.